So what is stress? Well, it's an adaptive response. Uh, when you're confronted with a stressor, something that uh, makes you anxious, um, you, you respond and your body tries to adapt. It's an attempt to gain equilibrium, get out of that state that you don't want to be in, in, into a normal state. Um, uh, leading experts sometimes refer to it, especially negative stress, is the rate of wear and tear on your body and on your systems. Leading researcher Hans Selye referred to the general adaptation syndrome and said, basically, there are three stages of stress reaction. First, there's the alarm reaction. And then there's the stage of adaptation and exhaustion. Stressor is a word to describe things that cause stress. So a stressor causes stress of various kinds. It's a producer of stress. It can be internal, such as a psychological factor, or it can be external, such as an environmental factor, including things like heat, cold, and altitude. The target zone for stress, to put it in context of other programs, uh, is to shoot for eustress or good stress. Eustress refers to positive stress. And we all have stress in our lives and want stress in our lives. And so sometimes uh, I like to compete in sports, and that causes positive stress. Uh, there's stress associated with uh, relationships, with getting married or, or whatever. But those are positive stressors. What we don't want is to have too little things stressing the system, uh, which would be a type of distress, bad stress, or too many things taxing the system, which would be another type of distress or bad stress. So it'll look at it that way, too little, too much stress, or a presence of stressors results in bad stress called distress. Or optimally, we would like to have enough stimulating positive stressors we refer to as eustress. But remember, what is distress for one may be eustress for another. One person's stressor is another person's pleasure.